Good evening, Rhonda. Um, I thought I'd share with you one of my favourite poems, um, which is Good Bones by Maggie Smith. And the reason, I don't think it's by that Maggie Smith. Uh, although it might be, who knows, she's multi-talented. But I've chosen it because it speaks of the two things that I'm going through at the moment, and I suspect lots of you are going through, which is horror at the savagery and brutality and awfulness of what's going on around us but the real hope that in all the decimation we might be able to build something better. So this is a poem that sort of says that. I haven't quite mastered how I can read it off this device, so what you'll probably see is my eyes flicking over, so I hope you don't mind. Life is short, though I keep this from my children. Life is short, and I've shortened mine in a thousand delicious, ill-advised ways. A thousand deliciously ill-advised ways... I'll keep from my children. The world is at least 50% terrible, and that is a conservative estimate, though I keep this from my children. For every bird, there is a stone thrown at a bird. For every loved child, a child broken, bagged, sunk in a lake. Life is short, and the world is at least half terrible, and for every kind stranger, there is one who would break you. Although I keep this from my children. I am trying to sell them the world. Any decent estate agent walking you through a real shithole chirps on about good bones. This place could be beautiful, right? You could make this place beautiful. <laughs>